melanomas can be the big black spots that you see in the magazines and those sort of things, but every one of those melanomas that you see, they started off very small. So every melanoma starts as one single cell uh, and nobody can see that, even I can't see that. And that's what having a regular check is about. If all we did was find the big scary melanomas that are in the magazines and there wouldn't be wouldn't be much of a job for us because everybody can pick those. So what having a skin check is about is trying to move that point of diagnosis from the big obvious things back down to the smaller, simpler ones. So if I'm talking to a patient about what to look out for, I like to keep it very broad and simple because if I tell someone 10 things to look out for, they're probably going to remember two of them by the time they walk out the door and none of them by the time they're six months down the track. So. Most adults will have lots of different spots on their skin, um, lots of normal things running around. So if you notice something that doesn't look like the other spots on your skin, something that's new or that's changed, that's worthwhile popping in for us to have a look at. It doesn't mean it's always something nasty, but it means that it's something that's worthwhile us passing the equipment over and, and getting a good look at. So there's, unfortunately, there's no hard and fast rule. So we see melanomas that are pitch black and we see melanomas that look like the normal skin sitting beside them, um, clear and white. So. Uh, if you were to look in a textbook, they'd tell you to look out for something that's bigger than six millimetres, that's asymmetrical, that the borders are irregular or there's different colours within it. So if you see those things, absolutely come in and get it to have a look at it. But even sort of simple spots, just like the pimple that won't heal or the ingrown hair that won't go away, little sort of things like that are, are worthwhile sort of having in the back of your mind as to when to pop out and see it. So, Generally melanomas, most of them will be pigmented, but some of them are. So you're looking for spots that are brown, um, usually flat. Uh, but for the non-melanoma skin cancers, you're usually looking for spots that are still skin coloured or pink or red uh, and, and those sorts of things. So there's a huge variety out there, which is why I like to keep my advice pretty broad, where if you find yourself thinking about something for more than a day, just book on in and come and see it.